Hello, great people. Trust God, you are well and good. This is Physic Court Fashion House channel. My name is Fola. Thank you so much for as many that has been subscribing to our channel. And as many that are yet to subscribe, do well to subscribe today. Thank you very much. Today I'll be teaching you how to make a basket with design. So to make your basket with design, the first thing you need to do is to cut out your stripe. So you can use a material of your choice. You can use the African prints and color material. But for this uh, tutorial, I'm, I'm using a, a plain cutting material. That's what I'll be using. And these are the stripes that have already been cut out. So it depends on the length you want to achieve, but the width, let it be one and a half. Because by the time you get your machine to sew it, this is the way you are going to fold it. So then you begin to sew it this way. So that's what we want to go and do now first. So these are the ones that have uh, sewn and have, uh, have ironed it properly. It's good you iron it before you start applying it. So the next thing to do now is to get a plain sheet of paper and you begin to want to draft something like a square type of a drawing there now. So it depends on how you know how close you want your basket to be but for this video we'll be using 1.5 you can use you can mark one one inch you can mark a 1.25 that is one quarter but for this one we are using 1.5 some people can even use two two inches but that one will be too wider so i'll be using 1.5 so you begin to mark your plain sheet 1.5 you do the same thing down here 1.5 you mark your 1.5 all through down here too then you mark the same 1.5 by the side you do the same thing you mark the same thing 1.5 by the two sides then you begin to connect it together. Then you begin to connect it together horizontally like this. So this is what we have after uh, ruling it, both uh, vertically and uh, horizontally. So the next thing to do now is to begin to go and be sewing our stripe on it, just this way. You begin to sew on it. Then you begin to, begin to join it on the line you've already ruled you start the with the horizontal one you can choose to start with vertical one yes. so now you can see that we have placed our stripe, I mean, horizontally. So the next thing to do is to begin to place the vertical ones now. Now, we have uh, successfully created our basket box, you can see. So, the next thing to do now, assuming you have the, uh, the size you want to use, maybe you have uh, measured it before starting to create your basket. 
if this is the size you need, the next thing you do is that you tear another stripe of like a one one centimeter. It's no no up to to half. Okay, one centimeter or half an inch, sir. So you you get those one to secure all this edge, but you don't fold this one to to so you don't sew this one because this one will eventually um, be attached to your to your real dress, the dress you are joining it to. So what you need to do is just to place this at this edge and just sew it on it like this. The essence of this is that if you don't do this before, because we are going to this, uh, remove this paper. If you don't do this before, you remove your paper. So this, um, or this one, the hedges here will not have a stamina. It will not have stability. There will be nothing to, to hold it. It will just be doing funny. But if you use this strap now just to, to secure it down like this, then you do the same thing at the edges, all the four corners, you do it. But for, for my home, the thing I want to use this uh, basket for is that I want to use it to, to cut out a, a moderate flay, I mean 180 degree flay for just, I mean, for the hand, for the sleeve. So what I will now do, if that will be, should be your case, what you do that you cut out whatever you need before you do that I explained to you now. You firstly cut, cut it out. So for me, I will cut out my flame before I now secure it with this thing, before I eventually attach it to the basic sleeve. The beauty of this basket is that you can use it for anything. You can use it to create anything. So. For me, I want to use it to create sleeve. I mean, flare like a bell sleeve. You can just use your pin to put it down. So, if you to want to create something like this, maybe you want to cut out a, a flay with this. If you don't know how to cut the flay, just check our our video on how to different type of a flay. Yes, this is what I need. So before I before I remove the paper, so I will ensure that uh, I secure all this with this. Because if I don't do that, the thing will lose uh, stamina on these edges. So I will sew it down just this way. I will do the same thing to the down part. I will use this uh, half an inch uh, stripe to hold it down. So we hold it down. I will sew on it just like this before I remove the paper. Now, I've used that uh, half an inch uh, stripe to, to secure all these uh, raw edges. You can see, I've used it to secure everything. So this side now, you know, this is flare that will be joined to the basic sleeve. So this place will serve as a seam allowance. This uh, this place will be joined together as seam allowance. But for this down part, uh, we're going to use a bias to to conceal all this. We're going to use bias to conceal this after that is after removing the paper. So. Now, the next thing is to remove the paper. So, you remove all those 
paper in such a way that everything we remove everything from the from the basket. You can see that as I'm removing it, there is no no paper there. You can see now we have removed the paper now see everything this is the right side this is the wrong side we have neatly removed the, the paper so you can see how beautiful it looks so as I told you you just use your bias tape just to to conceal this you saw at the wrong side so after swing it at the Wrong side, you turn it to the right side just to conceal this. So do that. So that's the only place that needs to be um, taped with bias. So every other thing, this side will be joined together with half an inch as your seam allowance for the side seam of the sleeve. So and this side this upper part will be joined to the basic sleeve so that's it so this uh, this basket when you are drawing you can draw it the way you like you can draw it diagonally just whatever you want you want to achieve it will give you so the moment you draw whatever you want on your paper so the results will come out nightly i'm sure you have enjoyed this uh, video so share with your friends, like it, drop your comment on the uh, comment section and make sure you subscribe to this uh, channel, Physique Court Fashion House. Thank you very much. See you next time.